Hello, Em. Hello, Tracy. It's lunchtime. Hello. Hello. I, 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 it is books at lunchtime, and I think you have a question today. I do have a question today. It's a, a really interesting one about what are people going to do who, even with all these books here and even with all of these videos, what are they going to do if they still just really don't know what they want to give people as a gift at Christmas? What a conundrum. What a conundrum. Well, luckily, we've got we've got an idea and we hope you're as excited about it as we are. Um, we've just started doing a lovely thing, um, a book subscription. And we it's this is new from, I think, October. Um, and really, it's a way of taking the responsibility of choosing books away from yourself and putting it onto us, uh, which we're delighted to um we're delighted to help out. So we have a few choices of book subscriptions. Um, and um, I think we'll run through and, and explain what our options are. So, so the subscription means that someone pays up front for a certain number of months and then we send them more than one book. Yes. So um, that's exactly right. So we ask a few questions when, when um, we start out. So we ask how many books you would like a subscription for whether you'd like them every month or every other month and then we obviously do the calculations so if you decide you'd like three books and you'd like them every other month then that would last you six months um, we can also send out um, 12 books every month and that would last you a year um, and then we can also offer adult fiction we can offer children's picture books children's bedtime stories or another option, which has actually been far and away our most popular one so far, which is called the Kets Book Club. So can you explain a bit about that, Tracy? Explain a bit about that. Um, okay, so I don't have the list right in front of me, but the, the idea is that because so many of our readers want to read a variety. Oh, thank you, look at that. They want to read a variety. So they don't want to get stuck in historical fiction, but they don't mind stopping there. A bit of crime is good. We've devised, Ems and David have devised this kind of menu or plan of what we're going to be reading on um, a monthly basis with our Kets Books Club. So for December, um, for instance, we're going to be sending out um, a book that is was published before 1960. Um, so M is working with our volunteer David to select these books and um, the, the Kets Books Club just gives a wider range of choices. There might be a book written in translation. We plan to include the book that we choose for our One Community, One Book next year and it gives people a wider range of nonfiction and fiction. So for instance, um, this one was this a fiction choice or a Kets That book was club? actually a fiction choice rather than a Kets say. Book Club choice. But yes, so the, the fiction choice um, is generally contemporary fiction. It's generally, oh, actually, the, the Lackberg there isn't a new, new book, but we think it's unusual enough that um, people would not have read it. Um, with that one, we'd like to know a little bit about books that you love, books that you don't. So we make sure if you really, really can't stand, you know, who done it, we don't send you any Agatha Christie. Um, but as with all of these things, a little bit of or a little bit of surprise is part of the thing. So if you're if you're just excited to be given something new, give us some guidelines and we'll we'll match you up with some books that um, we think you might find really interesting. They, um, David's working very hard to choose books that are unlikely to have been read, particularly if, if something job. has was published in um another continent and has only just come into paperback in the UK if it's not been published and we're really interested in those um, because people won't have read them but all, all kinds of surprises and that is one of the big the big points of it isn't it the surprise yes, it is definitely and and it, would you like to see what it looks like when it comes I'd in the mail love to see what it looks like so it comes in the mail like this oh that's beautiful so we're very eco we're very ecologically friendly here so it comes in brown paper it comes in fully recyclable um, paper tape, craft tape. So it all just goes in the recycling um, and a string, which can also be composted or recycled. And so this is the, this is a first one. It's got a little note there. So your recipient gets a note or a little card there just to say thank you. And then when you open it, so shall I show you what, what we actually sent out for the Kets Book Club last month? Yes, please. I, I haven't. 
Okay. <laughs> so last last month's one was in translation. So David um, found a really great Japanese book. So this was the book for last month called Strange Weather in Tokyo. Now, as you said, Tracy, this isn't new, but it's kind of newish to the UK because these translated books take a while to, to filter down. So this is the little book. And in addition to that, we, we make sure that when we send out the first one, we, we make sure you know how many you're getting, how often you're getting it. So we, you know, you you can keep that on the fridge to remind you. We also send out like tasting notes, really, as if you were having a fine wine. We put a few um, notes there for you. So a little bit about why we've chosen the book, other books that you might like if you enjoy that. So it gives you suggestions for further reading. And we do that with all the books that get sent out every month. So it's a little bit of a guided, a guided reading there. So it's a really, really nice present and it gets posted to your door um, when you, you know, monthly or bi-monthly, whatever it is. And um, it's, yeah, it's a great gift. It's, it is a great gift and a lot of people have been really excited about it actually so um, you and David have worked really really hard to pull this together and to make it something that's more that, than just a book it's a curated gift and yes, actually it it's very caring so and I, I will just say they're not always books in translation but they no. are always going to be books that people are unlikely to have come across yeah and as we said if we go back to the Ketz book club thing um so as you see uh November was a book in translation there so it's only going to be once a year um but it does just it, hopefully it just opens your eyes to some other books you might not have chosen that are out there and um sometimes that's really lovely you never know what you're going to like until you until you come across it it's you know known and unknown knowns isn't it as they yeah. they said no yeah. unknowns unknown so unknowns it's, um, it's all on our website or people can ring up it's all on the website um and there's a form that you that we have in the shop that you can fill in um and just leave it with us and it gets passed to me i will process it and 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 let you know that it's all been received and it's in progress um for the adult books you probably want to know a bit about pricing so the adult fiction and the Ketz book club are priced the same so three books um is 42 pounds so that's irrespective of how often you're getting them so whether you want them monthly or bi-monthly obviously that doesn't make a difference three books is 42 pounds six books is 84 pounds and if you want 12 books then that's 150 pounds um, that all includes postage and packaging and your little taste tasting notes inside um, for the children's books they're slightly less ex it's a slightly less expensive option three books is 35 six books is 70 and 12 books is 125 um, and those ones we do ask for a little bit more um, information from you as the purchaser because obviously all kids are massively different and we want to make sure we get the right book to the right word. Excellent so um, that's brilliant and I can't wait to um, hear people say that they have received those and how excited they were um you've had some comments from people and, wow. and actually some of our other volunteers have received them as gifts um and yeah that people seem really genuinely thrilled to see it it comes through the letterbox yeah. we all need some actual mail through the letterbox don't we it's nice to actually get something through the post and i will say briefly that I was a guinea pig for this last year and my husband got me a subscription for my birthday and it was incredible. It was really, it was just wonderful to see what I would get every month. And some stuff was, you know, all sorts of things from fiction to nonfiction, from really big books to really, you know, uh, much smaller, more literary books. And it's been an absolute treat just to, just to have the, the choice responsibility taken away from me. And um, yeah, it's definitely opened my eyes to, to new reading material in quite excellent. a profound way so i hope we can share that as well with you excellent okay well thank you ever so much you and david for putting this oh, together sorry. and um we will answer any questions by email or oh, we do have an email address don't we we do yeah okay. it's um subs at ketz.uk ketzbooks.co.uk subs at ketzbooks yeah uk so yeah or ring us so that's great thank you very much em no problem see you later bye